frost in the morning, right? Frost is going to happen with the clear skies, the cold temperatures, and you're going to want to bundle up, especially headed out the door. Take a look at Pinpoint Doppler. Here we go. Starting the trend, you'll notice over the next five to seven days, a clear sweep. We're looking here at 1116, and you'll notice the clear sweep going across eastern Kentucky as low pressure moving off to the east coast. There's the northwest winds bringing in cooler temperatures and high pressure is situated to the west, going to be moving in and clearing things out for us. Temperatures right now 43 degrees in Jackson, 41 in Louisville, and you'll notice the 40s all the way to the north. That colder air really starting to work its way southward and high temperatures only reached the lower 50s in Jackson, 52 in Harlan, as well as Pikeville, and slightly warmer in Middlesbrough at 55 degrees. Now, temperatures right now, you'll see a big difference, especially with the ridges and valleys. Look at out to the west, 30 degrees in Monticello, 36 in Somerset, and we're still looking at the ridges sitting into the lower 40s. They'll drop tonight. No worries, clouds still clearing out, and once they do, we'll see that frost develop tonight. The cooler weather will stick around for late week, but that chilly start for the weekend, all because cold front number two makes a return to eastern Kentucky. So we're going to be watching not one, but two systems of cold shot air here moving in. Notice the first one, frost advisory. We're already impacted by this cold front on the back side of things. Thursday from 3 a.m. to 9 a.m. This is all because the clearing skies, no winds. Therefore, we'll see some frost tonight as temperatures drop down near freezing. And with that, it dries things out. Look at the 12 hour planner here. We're looking 3 a.m. 38 degrees 34 by 5 o'clock. Of course, chilly and colder in those valley areas. Patchy frost for 7 a.m. and calm as we head into 9 o'clock. Now notice we are clear high pressure taking over to our south, but notice clouds increasing from the north. What might that be? Well, here comes cold front number two at this point around noon on Friday would be up to the the north near Ohio, Indiana, going to slide its way down from the north, bringing in another reinforcing cold shot of air. And you'll see that here. Friday's high temperature 60 degrees for Veterans Day, 52 for Saturday. And look at the low temperature on Saturday, the coldest we've had in quite some time 29 degrees. The forecast for Jackson, of course, valley area is going to be into the mid 20s. And then look at this 63 degrees. So Tanner average is around 61. We don't see anything too high, too low. I think falls here to stay in the mountains. All right, Andrew. Thanks. He's